Hi everyone, we're going to look at now how to do dividing with two different polynomials. So the top one here, we've got a trinomial because there's three pieces, one, two, three, divided by a monomial, which is just one piece. And what I usually show my students is to take this fraction and just kind of split it up. I want you to think about this as if it was like 10 plus 2 divided by 2. What you could do is you could do 10 over 2 plus 2 over 2 separately because that's a little bit easier to do. And the reason this works is you're essentially, by, you're factoring out the 1 half in this case because if this is divided by 2, that's the same thing as doing 10 plus 2 times the reciprocal, 1 half, like that. And then, then you, once you factor that out, you could distribute that in because 1 half times 10 plus 1 half times 2 is the 10 over 2 plus 2 over 2. So you could definitely do this. You can divide each part by the denominator as long as you divide every single part by that denominator piece. So that's what we're going to do. It makes it a little bit easier to think about. So we're going to divide um, the negative 100 x to the 15th. That'll be divided by negative 10 x to the 9th. And then we're going to do plus negative 60 x to the 12th divided by negative 10 x to the 9th plus negative 50 x to the 16th divided by negative 10 x to the 9th. And let's divide every single piece separately by that negative 10 x to the 9th. So we'll do the numbers first. This would be positive 10. Then we're going to subtract our exponents. So um, x to the uh, 6 here would be the power of x. 15 minus 9 is 6. And then plus, again, divide the numbers first. You get 6. And then subtract your exponents, x to the third. Plus, divide the numbers. You get 5. Subtract the exponents. You get x to the, oh, that's not the fifth. That would be the seventh. 16 minus 9 there for the exponent, which would be 7. That's how we do division when it's written like a fraction. If it's not written like a fraction, we're going to make it like a fraction. We're going to do the same thing here. We're going to take the first thing in parentheses, and we're going to make it the numerator. And we're going to divide this whole thing by the 5x squared. And again, we're going to split it up. So negative 5x to the 10th divided by 5x squared plus 25x to the 6th divided by 5x squared plus 15x to the 9th divided by 5x squared. And we'll just divide each piece and then we'll be done. So negative 5 divided by 5 is negative 1. x to the 8th, you subtract the exponents there, plus 5x to the 4th. Divide the numbers, subtract the exponents, there we go. Plus 3x to the 7th and we're done. That's all you have to do for dividing polynomial expressions.